and if you're new, hey what's up? My name is Tanya and thank you all so much for joining in and watching this video. As usual, there will be timestamps listed down below so you can jump around and if you like what you see, smash that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and thumbs this video up. You want to become a part of the Fawn family, Fawn squad, and you have to be subscribed to be a part of the Fawn family, and you're just missing out if you're not, so just what are you waiting for? Just smash that button and then we can get on with the show. All right, so this video shout out has to go to Kelly Wolf. Kelly, it has been a long time since you've had a shout out and I know I'm always trying to welcome new fawns, but I just feel like I need to give you a shout out. I want to give you a long distance hug. It has just been way too long since like I feel like I've chatted with you on camera since we've had a little girl time and you're you've just been so awesome and I feel like a lot of the OG fawns seem to have become more silent or have moved on or maybe they just are more busy now or whatever the case may be not all of them because I mean there's still Christy there's still Tyra there's Dina we've got grandma Janet you know there's still a lot of them but there's also a lot of girls that are getting a little bit more quiet and Kelly you have stayed so strong and you're always commenting on every video and I just want to let you know that it means so much every time I see a comment pop up from you and that I love you so much and you mean the world to me. I am so grateful for you. I'm so grateful that you are supporting me along this journey, that you found my channel so long ago, that you subscribed so long ago, that you became a part of my Fawn family so long ago, and that you have just stuck it out with me and I just cannot wait for the day that I actually get to meet you in person and give you a, per, a hug in person and I actually get to see you. So Kelly, this one is for you and lots of hugs and kisses from our bordering state all the way to you from Michigan. Now this video I'm so excited about because I got a little PR from Lottie London and it came in the cutest package ever. It's pink, it's holographic, and it came with like all of this like confetti-ish strings and everything holographic that is so fun. Like I am obsessed. I'm not throwing this out. I'm like finding ways to either I have to frame or shadow box or something. Like my first PR from every single company I have to do something with when everything is completely organized on different walls because it's just to me it means so much that like Lottie London has recognized and sent something over to me too like I can't even it just it's incredible so this shout out also goes to Lottie London thank you so much for sending me a little PR it meant it means so much to me and I freaking love this so much that this is probably going to replace my holy grail that has not left my side since it launched. Are you guys ready? It's going to probably replace my Mac roller wheel and my Tom Ford eye defining pen. No joke. I'm not kidding you. I introduce you to the Lottie London Stamp Liner. This blew me away. I am in love. This is ridiculously amazing. I was so scared you guys are gonna crack up during the demo or during the unboxing when I realized, because. When I got this, I like just peeked inside just so I would know what the item was, so I would know what what point in my makeup to stop to use it. So I just thought that I was getting, that this was like a new liquid liner. So I was expecting to do like a normal wing eyeliner. 
oh, this eye, always. Uh, so we'll focus over here. <laughs> so I peeked and I saw uh, something that said, where was it? This was on it, wing, wing it out. So I was like, okay, good. I, I have a new li uh, liquid um, liner. So I left the box alone and I didn't look at anything. And I received this actually like 10 days, maybe two weeks ago, but I just didn't have a chance to actually film with it yet. Cause I've just been like, go, 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 go. And so then when I sat down here and I started reading it, I was like, oh my God. And I did like this cut crease like the crazy cut, cut crease and I'm like how am I gonna make a stamp like this work I've never used something like this this is so innovative and I was so excited about it and so I'm like but I was so scared to use this so I did my left eye first and I actually messed it up because it was my first time using a tool like this I'm sorry my allergies my nose is so itchy and everything's like running and just I'm gonna be a mess for like the next six months so I'm sorry if this irritates you I there's nothing I can do about it um yeah but my legs are falling asleep as you see my pajama pants <laughs> so I start reading the how to and I'm like oh my god <laughs> like I I don't know if I can do this so I and then it comes on the other end like a normal marker. And this is fantastic. It is jet black, matte black, just glides over. It is, wait, just wait for the demo. Honestly, you guys need to watch the demo. This is like magic. I, can't, I have to go buy a backup because this is so good. And the stamp is perfection. It is just like the right size of a, of a wing. So you put the base like at the corner and the reason why I messed up the first side was because I like put the stamp on but I like just kind of stamped it so I didn't get the full effect of a stamp and I didn't quite place it correctly. So then I learned from my mistake on the one eye and then when I came to this eye, this eye, even though it's now my, this is the leaky eye, but I got it perf perfectly. So you have to actually put it down on the base and then when it's on the base, you mesh it up and then you want to push it down and then push, 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 push like that. And then you'll get your perfect wing. I didn't mean to actually do that when I was lifting up to show you guys, but that's all you want to do is push down and then go up. And then you'll get a complete stamp that's full. So you won't actually have that stupid thing that I just did. You'll have it. It'll be because I can't I was like on an angle. It'll be a perfect wing that'll be completely filled in and it is amazing. And so when I did the second one, I got it perfect. That's how quickly this is like how quickly it is to learn how to use this. I was amazed. And then when I used the other side to fill it in, it was so easy to glide over all the metallic shade shadows that I have down. It was so black, so matte, so budge proof. This is bomb. It is. It retails for seven dollars and forty nine cents U.S. At, or five ninety five euros. And it was it launched sometime in February. I just didn't get on it fast enough. I'm really sorry. Um, I don't know if I still have juice in my makeup wipe or not. I know this is pretty dried out. <laughs> yep. <laughs> this is pretty budge proof, you guys. Like, it does not, it, yeah, there's not enough juice in this. This is, like, no joke. Like, this is pretty dang waterproof. 
yeah, that's just rubbing me raw. Uh, so this is honestly so incredible and so simple once you get the hang of it and you get the hang of it really, really quickly. And I didn't think that I was going to be able to use it. Honestly, I thought like I'm going to make a fool out of this product and I'm going to embarrass Lottie London and they're going to regret sending me this product and I'm like never going to get PR from them again because I'm going to do the worst job ever demoing this product and it's going to be a disaster and you know, like I'm thinking like just no, this, mm me no I can't I can't do things like that like there's no way but no it's actually so easy to use I'm like and I, I did read the instructions twice because I was that scared that I read it twice <laughs> I don't know I'm such a chicken with wing liner I think because I didn't I didn't do it my whole life and then at 31 30 and a half 30 and a half when I started my channel is when I, I was almost actually 31 when I started trying to do wing liners because I was like November and I turned 31 in January and that's when I started trying to teach myself how to do wings and how to do lashes. And I think that's what my issue is, is that I just never did false lashes and I never did a wing my entire life. And so I have like this fear every time there's like something new to do with like a wing liner or lashes. Oh, this drives me crazy. But look, it's not moving now. Like now it's like, oh, it's, <laughs> I have to like really tug on it and it's hurting my eye to really tug on it. I should not do that. I should just let it run because it's just, ew. so anyway, this is fantastic. If you guys are scared, trust me, I feel your pain. I was terrified, but this really does work. And at the price point, it is so worth it for you guys to try and just practice and practice and practice, especially if one, you're new to wing liners, two, you're like an intermediate, or three, you just don't have the time in your day to do a wing liner because this just takes that time and the guesswork and everything out. You just have to spend like the two seconds to line it up. And I did it with like this tricky AF eye look because I didn't know it was a stamp. I thought it was just liquid liner. So I even approached it with like a really tricky eye look and I still managed to pull it off. So I promise you guys, you can do this and it's going to be worth it if you try it and you try it and you try it. Practice a couple times at night if you're scared to do it right before work or, or going out. Just take a couple shots at it and you're gonna fall in love with this product. I cannot recommend it enough. I'm so excited about it and I never ever ever would have tried this if they hadn't sent it over to me. So I'm even more appreciative that they sent it over to me because it's such a bomb product and I would have been too scared to try it. So I feel you guys on the pain and I'm not trying to just sell you on it. I'm trying to like just sell you on it on the sense that it's so incredible because I was so scared and I just don't want you guys missing out on a good thing that could really be a game changer for you if you're struggling with wing liner. So just try, try it out. You, you have nothing to lose, I promise you. I cannot see you guys regretting trying this. And don't get frustrated. Have fun with it, especially if you're just practicing it right before you take your makeup off in the evening. Just have fun trying to stamp it out. Like I was having like anxiety trying it out because you know I'm trying it out for you guys and I'm like I don't want to fail at this but just have fun with it. I mean I sometimes forget that myself at the end of the day it's makeup. Let's have fun. I have to remind myself too like to chill out sometimes. So just have fun. I've been talking for 15 minutes. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to stop talking now so you guys can see me have my little meltdown and then the demo and 
how amazing it turns out on the one eye. And here you go. All right, I'm in the middle of a very dramatic eye look, as you can tell, but it is time to do my wing, my liquid eyeliner. And Lottie London sent over PR. I've never received any, and look how cute this presentation is. And it has all these little fun iridescent, like, I don't even know what you call that the little strips of like goodness that's coming out of this box. I am in love with everything. Pink, iridescent, everything about this. This is like the cutest PR package ever. So thank you so much to Lottie London for sending this to me. Like I just love it. And I barely ever talk about Lottie London too, but like today for instance, I'm using the Lottie London AM to PM Eye Coal Pencil. I've tight lined with it and I will be doing my waterline with it. This is what I used on Kurt too because I knew his eyes would be watering when I was doing like the husband challenge for his makeup because obviously you never tight he's never had his eyes tight lined and water lined and this holds up like no other eye pencil I'm serious like this one outdoes my Marc Jacobs my Urban Decay 24 7 like this one I can count on to hold up so this is amazing and I can't believe that they sent me some PR because I just I never really dedicated a video to Lottie London before but this is like my holy grail eyeliner when I need liner to not go anywhere so just to point that out to you guys I'm obsessed with this one so let's take oh this is I don't want to dump it all but that's what it looks like on the inside there's so much oh my gosh I am obsessed with this it's like oh, all falling out but I really want to show you guys I know you're getting an idea of it maybe if I take out what it do, 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 do. <laughs> isn't that so cool I love it I love these little touches so obviously I had peaked at opening it and it had said wing out but I had not actually looked at this so I nothing else I don't know anything about it except wing out and that was it because you guys know I like to not know anything ahead of time all oh, these sent stickers support your total girl thing Lottie London yes and that oh my god my step girls are going to go insane for those stickers like, let me tell you, but I kind of want to keep the Lottie London one. I probably will keep the Lottie London one, and I'll let them have the other ones. <laughs> All right, so this bad boy is stamp liner. Oh, stamp and eyeliner duo. Wings made easy. Lottie London is cruelty free too, by the way. Oh my gosh, what have I gotten myself into for today? Maybe this is not an appropriate look to be using this with because I want like with this crazy, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is what it looks like. All right, let's see. Wings made easy. Meet your fierce new best friend Lottie London stamp liner wing edition your game-changing liner stamp and pen designed to effortlessly create perfect winged eyeliner in no time featuring a double-ended design with a stamp on one end and a pointed tip on the other creating symmetrical flick Creating symmetrical flicks couldn't be easier. You'll never be late because of winged eyeliner again. Oh my goodness, has wing eyeliner eyeliner made me late in the past. <laughs> How to use. Step one, begin with the wing-shaped stamp at the outer corner of each eye and press down firmly. The jet black ink creates a perfect wing with just one application. Top tip, looking straight ahead. Oh my God, I'm nervous. 
point the wing stamp upward diagonally so that it looks like a continuation of your lower lash line. Step two is using the pointed felt tip, join the wing to the top lash line and say hello to the easiest cat eye you've ever created. The long lasting formula means your fierce flicks that won't budge all day or all night. Uh, it's saying that this is available at Lottie London, Superdrug, ASOS, Alta, Forever 21, and Riley Rose. And it will retail for $7.49 or in Euros $5.95 and it's launching in February and I have had this for um, maybe a week, week and a half, but I haven't been filming too much uh, because of my boys and you guys already know everything. So this is probably out already. I might need the hubby to break into this because I did just get my nails done and I don't know. Let me see if I like crinkle it. No. Hmm. About my scissors. Oh, take it. <laughs> I'm like, I want to do it, but I don't want to break my nails. My nail tech would be very mad at me. She spent a really long time doing this. Where are my tweezers? I just don't want to go kick hurt. We're gonna do this. It's happening. This is sealed really well. Like, this is not drawing up sitting on a shelf at all. I am so nervous right now and so curious at the same time, but I had no idea that this was a stamp wing. I thought that this was just like a, oops, a new, a uh, liquid eyeliner or I wouldn't have done the type of eye look that I just did. <laughs> Come on! Oh no, I'm getting black everywhere because the cat... Okay, let's put the cat back on. <laughs> I hope you guys are entertained right now. <gasps> yes, that just happened. I just wasted so much ink. <laughs> that super sucks. Uh, I still have my before it dries down because Lottie London is really, it's like legit budge proof. Okay. I don't want this trying anywhere. Oh my gosh. Okay, are we good? Okay, no black. Okay, let's look at the stamp. Okay, that's not the stamp either. Didn't I just... There's the stamp. Oh my gosh. <sighs> okay, I'm so like die hard li like living for this box right now. I can't even tell you. I'm like, this is perfection for in here. Okay, let me grab my mirror. Mm, okay, we're gonna put the hair up. <laughs> okay. Okay, zoom you guys in. Okay. That's not it. Okay. So, we take this baby at the outer corner, press firmly down. For the tip, you want to look straight ahead, point the wing upward diagonally so it looks like a continuation of your lower lash line. Okay. Okay. 
okay? See, these things take some practice. That one is better. Okay, this side worked out so well. <laughs> this side, I definitely messed up on. Okay. So the trick is to start, but then roll it all the way to the tip because that's how I got this one so dead on was by starting it at the bottom pushing it and then rolling it so it would be all even and that made a huge difference compared to this side which is going to be hard for me to clean up but I'll do that off camera so this does work. It is genius. That was so easy once you kind of know how to go about using it. Ooh, I like this. That's jet black, matte black, and that just glided over all that metallic so easily. I think there's just like a little bit of a learning curve to this, but I really think that this is a wicked product and I just did like the wrong kind of eye look because if I did a normal one where this wasn't dragged out all the way and you know I stopped it and didn't do a full on cut crease, like that would look like a completely normal wing. It's just the type of eye look I have going on right now. I just didn't realize because I didn't look ahead of time and wanted to be surprised. But I mean, you guys can see that. Like that would be spot on perfection. And then this was just, you know, first time. So I messed it up and I'm gonna have to go clean it up now. But I think that this is a really great product. And I mean, look at that. One time was a flop and then the next time, bam. So. Now that you guys have seen me use it, you probably be able to get it on the first try, no problem. So I'm absolutely going to continue using this and trying it out more and more and more. And this might even be easier than the Mac Roller Wheel, which is incredible. And I'm all about that. And this is, you know, $7.50 essentially compared to $21 from a Mac roller wheel, which I then have to combine with my Tom Ford eye defining pen and I'm loving this. So that is it for this little mini video. Please thumbs it up if you liked it. Please share it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, good night, good morning, wherever you are. I love you guys so much and I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.